Marketing a show in today's media-savvy climate is a technological feat. Gone are the days when a newspaper ad and a TV commercial could launch a show. Marketing has changed drastically. Everything is digital and everything else is online and the 24-hour news cycle, so we always need to be up with the most current trends and on top of what's going on with the latest technology and ensuring that we can reach our audiences as we can. There are now several social media platforms and the content posted on one looks different on another. I have to stay up to date with the changing algorithms and with the constantly changing new trends. Marketing team is trying to articulate what this show is in two sentences or less to ensure that audience understand what they're about to see. Uh, pop concert, musical theater production, hist historical retelling of the Six Wives of Henry VIII. There's a lot of different contexts. Um, so just trying to make it as clear and concise and exciting as possible. Six has its own unique persona and voice when you're communicating with the queendom. The voice is confident, sassy, inclusive, joyful, and empowering. We got a lot of uh, positive feedback when we announced the cast, like everyone's so excited. Can't wait, purple hearts, yay. One of the fun things we're working on right now is an Instagram filter where anyone can become a queen. So you'll see yourself like wearing a, ca a crown and coming royalty. Already got my throne, just waiting for my crown. That's nice. I think we're definitely going to try and reach audiences all across social media, TikTok, Instagram, uh, Facebook, Twitter, just trying to see where audiences are and meet them where they are um, so they can come in and see the joy. We asked the queendom, guess which of the queens survived and they got the answers right. Catherine Parr, Catherine Parr. I'm mostly excited about building the queendom and connect with them on social, like ask them to share their experiences and passion about the show, especially that this show is both a lot of fun as well as empowering. I love musicals, I love arts, the arts, and I love storytelling. Um, so to get to be a part of the community and the energy of bringing that to life in Toronto, um, it's just it's so great. And marketing is, is a public facing um, aspect of the performing arts, but you don't actually have to be on stage. So it's kind of the best of both worlds. Oh, look, the Instagram filter is ready. Victoria, take a look. <laughs> oh, I feel like a queen.